Kelly Riley told me, Sharon, you're going to go down in history. You're going to be used for years to come. That's what Atley told me. Now, I thought, all right, great, Atley, I won, right? Brown v. versus Board of Education, remade Sharon Martin versus Minneapolis District Number 1, right, Atley? And then you said you had to go to Massachusetts and Amy was going to finish my case. Me and Amy worked together for less than 90 days. How many years did you put up with me, Adley? <laughs> Amy got kicked to the curb real quick, did she? Why? Well, I thought she was discriminatory, prejudiced. I thought she was overbearing. I thought she was trying to bully me. I thought that she was trying to manipulate the courts, right? Starting with Judge Krauss. So Amy got kicked to the curb real quick. So under Amy Jane Getz's case study, Adley... You know, who did you hand me to next after Amy Jane Getz? Keith? Was that Bernie Saunders and Keith? You know, because as we do these case studies, I'm tagging dollar amounts, ain't I, Atley? The last time I tagged a dollar amount, it was $417.6 million, right, Atley? Because I hired you as an attorney to sue District Number 1, violations based on discrimination. You said that you took the discrimination out under, you know, LaFlave, and then, Atley, you and Amy took me to 29, correct? Where 29 left that case sit on his desk for two years, and then I wrote a complaint to Michael Gaines. And I said, you know, slap him on the hand. Give him a warning. You know, don't let people like Amy Jane Getz, Ali Riley, Laura T. Booth come in your courtroom, manipulate paperwork, showing boobs, tits and ass. You know, tits are different than boobs because tits are smaller, I think. Anyways, with that being said, be very clear that when you did that, Ali Riley, and I thought that first case where housing court, where Joshua R. Williams was the clerk and you look like the judge, Atley, that was the first time I had an anxiety attack. So be very clear, Atley, Riley, Joshua R. Williams, even Barack Obama, Joe Biden, Donald Trump. Under that case study, be very clear. Each time you use that case study, I'm tagging $417.6 million to each one starting now.